Hello, welcome to the tutorial on how to get um, Windows Microsoft XP Paint on Windows 7 or to just actually find your Windows XP Paint if you lost it. Um, this is basically how to get it back. So you're going to go and click Start to begin with and go to your My Computer. From there, you're going to click your default disk drive. For instance, mine is C. Most computers on XP will be C. Um, and any other Microsoft computer, so double click that and you're going to go to your Windows file. So again, I am on XP, maybe different on Windows 7. Once there, look for your Windows System 32. You just scroll down a bit. Once you find it, double click that. Seems like my computer is being too slow. Not a problem. Once the drives come up, like mine, you're going to scroll and look for MS Paint icon. The letters are alphabetized, so you shouldn't have a problem finding it. There's the icon. Now you can do whatever you want. Make a backup. I'm going to go ahead and uh, put it in the flash drive so I can transfer it to the Windows 7 computer. And it's just uh, easy as drag and drop. Mine is already in there. Other than that, you close everything, and we're going to get ready to go to Windows 7 computer. Okay, so we're back on the Windows 7 computer, and um, for this purpose, this, this computer is also to its uh, theme, so you can see the transition. And um, But anyway, we have paint on our flash drive, so just go ahead, just plug it back in. I just And it's just as simple as dragging and dropping, and there you go, you just have paint. And I even have mine is to personally put it in here and to show you that it works take the flash drive out and it works just fine um, this is the way I like it the way the reason I personally like this is because I can do this whereas to in the Windows 7 paint you cannot um, and they don't conflict or anything they work together just fine you can open them with both just open them separately um, not like this you can have them running at the same time, when you open something, when you open with paint, it's automatically going to go to this. You can set the default to this, but I would just drag and drop to the to MS Paint, or I would just open MS Paint and open the picture from that. But that was the only thing I had a problem with. This was really annoying to me, because that's how I would draw. And to show you that they don't conflict each other, I can just open them both. And they're both fine. They're both there. So uh, thanks for watching. This is a simple video. I hope this uh, helped anyone find their paint. And um, also, the same procedures goes with Windows 7. It's practically the same thing. It might not be in the systems 32, but it's definitely in your Windows folder. Um, I personally like this. I just use Windows 7 paint to edit. So thanks for watching.